Welcome back everyone. You may be in a position where for some reason you keep trying to send photos or videos via iMessage but for some reason nothing is sending. Maybe you keep seeing you know this photo can't be sent, maybe this video can't be sent or some other type of you know message like that. Well if that's the case what you're going to have to do is pretty much try to understand what the specific problem is. So in this case you want to make sure you're connected to a good data connection, a good Wi-Fi, good whatever the case is. If you have SIM card installed you want to make sure you're getting signal and a great way to test this is to make your way over to your internet browser like this and you want to scroll around see how long it takes you to scroll if it's very fast if it doesn't take too much time to go and click on other things on the website too then you probably have a good internet connection if it takes a very long time or you're getting like oh network problems or no network connection whatever then you're probably going to have to actually connect to a better cell signal it's not guaranteed but that's a very great way to actually going ahead and trying it out now let's say you have a great network connection but for some reason iMessage still isn't sending those photos. Well then what you want to do at that point is make sure that your specific, you know, photo that you're sending is an appropriate photo that's actually, you know, in good case that's actually a suitable format for Apple to send. So things like .heics, JPEGs, PNGs, those type of images can be sent. But if you're trying to send something that's not even showed in your photos gallery, it shows in your files app and it's not even appropriate and it's not even a compatible photo, well, you're going to have some problems there. So you want to go ahead and make sure that's the case. But also you want to make sure that the person you're sending the photo to has signal as well. I've been in situations where I try to send a photo to somebody, but it can't be received on their end. So then it just doesn't send. So I don't know why that happens. Typically it would just send when they get signal again, but sometimes that doesn't happen. So as long as they have signal, they should be able to get it. But also so if you're trying to send a bunch of photos or a very big video at the same time, you're going to have to store those photos or videos in iCloud or Google Drive before sending them out. So in this case, let's say I wanted to go ahead and send this photo to somebody, right? Well, I can go and click the share button right here and I can also get a iCloud link and I can either copy a link to it and store it on iCloud or I can post it on Dropbox or Google Drive and I can just send them a link via that Google Drive link, you know, from messages to them. So that's another easy way to do it. So if I go and click here, click save to files, I can go and click save to here or whatever, right? If I go make my way over to my files app, which is right here, and if I go and click on the photo right here, you can see I will get a little share option here and I can go ahead and share file in iCloud. So that's another way to do it. You can go get a link for it. You can send it to somebody via iMessage like this. So that's another way to do it. Again, it's not like the best way. It's kind of like a two-step process, but if it's not working in any other way, that's a pretty much guaranteed way to fix it. If it's still not working at this point, you can try updating your iPhone, you can try resetting, restarting your iPhone, different things like that. But typically you should be good to go for the most part. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly, that everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.